So in here we've got some silver perch. Um, they're sort of feeding on a little carcass on the bottom of the tank. So what's happened is one of these fish have died and the other ones are all feeding off it. And providing that it's getting um, digested quite quickly or broken down quite quickly, it's safe enough to leave it here. But you need to be very careful if you do leave the carcass in the aquarium that it doesn't overpopulate, it doesn't um, produce too much organics and and um, biologically break down and pollute your aquarium. So this dead body that's on the bottom of the aquarium right there in the corner, if it's getting consumed by these fish, then by all means you can leave it there. But just be aware of um, polluting the aquarium with this decayed body. If in doubt, it's better to get it out. But this is very normal activity that goes on. When when one fish die, the other one take advantage of the misfortune of that fish and eat it. It's all part of nature. So these fish silver perch are very aggressive Australian native fish and they really do better in a busy fish tank. So good water flow and plenty of fish and you find that they're quite good. If you don't have many of these, you find they're very skitty and very aggressive. But as you can see, they're repeatedly coming back and feeding off the dead one. And they're um and this main one that's doing most of the feeding is acting quite territorial. So you'll see it's spending just as much time chasing the other fish away from the food because he's very protective of that food. like a dead fish bodyguard trying to make sure that he gets the best share of it it's the way life goes